Hey guys, it's Brian again with another ceiling fan video. What I have for you here is a 36 inch Homestead Whisper Fan 3 ceiling fan from the early 1980s. This uses a General Electric stack motor with a metal flywheel. It has a solid state variable speed control built into the fan. It uses the same pull chain sequence as the Slumber Quiet and earlier Casablanca models where it goes fan only, light only, fan and light, and then off. Has a reverse switch. I'm going to go ahead and show you the fan with the light off. This is not an original globe for this fan. This is something that I added, but this is basically what the fan would have looked like from the factory because Homestead did offer this exact glass. Although I'm not entirely sure if this came from Homestead or Casablanca, one of the two, quite honestly. I know this is either Homestead or Casablanca. You know, honestly, they both kind of offered the same glass options, so, you know, tomato, tomato. Um, it also uses the same mounting hardware as a early pre-hang true Casablanca with the bell canopy and the spiral down rod. Homestead apparently did buy a lot of their parts from Casablanca to use on their fans. These blades are absolutely gorgeous. This one I picked up from... Brian Hicks. Uh, this was originally in a habitat in his hometown that he had actually installed and uh, he um, was communicating with me and I indicated that I was looking for a Whisper Fan 3 asking him if he had any in his possession and he said well I know where there is one so he picked that one up from the habitat store where he had installed it and sold it to me. And you can see that I did not pay, you know, pennies on the dollar for this fan. This was not a cheap fan. This is probably one of the more expensive fans that I've bought in my life, but it was totally worth it because Homestead Whisper fans, any of the four Whisper Fan series fans, are pretty much major childhood fans for me. I've seen these in so many places, but the six blade Homesteads, even the Universals, are very very childhood for me but I love the whisper fans I'll show you the solid state control there and this one has an off position just like all the other ones you can see it goes from high to low put it on the lowest setting I'm gonna go ahead and fire this up with the light on It does have a decently audible hum to it, and the reason for that is a few reasons. Uh, first of all, it has a metal flywheel. Second of all, uh, this fan originally came with a slope ceiling uh, kit, which it's actually hanging on right now, but instead of using the slope canopy, I'm using the standard bell canopy. So that doesn't have any kind of isolation for noise. That moves a pretty nice little gentle breeze on the lowest speed here. I like this. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a slight turn on the control. One of the blades is slightly out of balance. It might even be the flywheel, but it does have a little bit of a wobble to it. Used to see these fans a lot in Kentucky Fried Chicken uh, stores when I was a kid. It was a mix between Homestead Whisper fans or Universals and Casablanca fans. Got the turn on the control. So I always have memories of Kentucky Fried Chicken when I see these 
Whisper Fan 3s, Whisper Fan 4s, Universals. The earlier Whisper Fans you really didn't see anywhere when I was a kid. I don't remember seeing them anywhere. That's a pretty powerful little fan. Definitely up in the K55 category of air movement. Let's go ahead and flip the controller all the way up to high. Has a little bit of a wobble to it, but it's not, you know, terrible. It's definitely moving a lot of air. I mean, this thing is really powerful. I'll show you the other part that I have for this fan. Here's the other canopy. This is the slope adapter. And then that's the down rod that it came with, which actually came with two, the one that's on it and then the longer one. But I used the short one for obvious reasons. But this fan originally, and I apologize for the mess, I'm doing a little bit of fan inventory clean out. I still have a bunch of people that need to pick up stuff from me. The original part that this would have been hanging on is pretty much the same thing as a Casablanca bell canopy, which is that triangular piece on the top and then the mounting bracket with the bolt that goes through its rubber isolators. And that's the reason why this fan, and one of the reasons why this fan is so noisy because it doesn't have those rubber isolators. It's hanging on a ball socket, like my Whisper Fan 2, that came with it. It's a little bit easier and more convenient for me to install that rather than to take apart a Casablanca that has all that stuff on it in my collection, so yeah. I really like this little fan. This is a cool little fan. So let's go ahead and shut her down. And do spin down. One of the neat things about this fan is that from the factory, they give you instructions with it that um, basically tell you how to take the variable speed out of this fan and use it as a wall control. Because the speed control in this fan has an off position, you're actually able to do that. So you can control the fan from the wall if it's too high up or if you just don't want to control it on the fan, which I thought was kind of interesting and almost ingenious, really. I mean, you know, it's got a built-in wall control if you don't want to you know, bust your knuckles on those blades when they're spinning to change the speeds on the fan. Unfortunately, in this house, I only have single pole applications and I don't feel like running separate wiring for the light. So I am pretty much just gonna leave this as is because I like it the way it is. Um, I do have a shorter uh, down rod for it and I'll have to cut the uh, down rod sleeve a little bit shorter because it just hangs way too low. I'm afraid that somebody's going to hit it and break it. So this is not how it's going to permanently hang, but it's a pretty cool fan. I'll put some pictures at the end of the video of the catalog, um, the digital scans that I have, and also the top uh, motor tag. But that's it. That's the 36 inch Homestead Whisper Fan 3. Hope you guys enjoyed. Keep watching. More videos to come.